Hey, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is A.A. Ron in real life. I am A.A. Ron, and thank you so much for watching. This is going to be a Nindies showcase from Nintendo uh, as of March 20th, 2019. I, this is a 25-minute presentation from Nintendo. I mean, it's just indie tiles, but so far... Switch has been coming out with some really solid indie games. Uh, so uh, there's bound to be something good in here. Let's check it out. Good morning. I am Dr. J.M. Lounsbury from the Ministry of Drink and Health Regulation. While many working adults start their this day with different. coffee, we recommend to switch to milk to complete your regimen of nutrifying activity. If you are making the switch, a very great annoyance which occurs often with milk occurs during the pouring of it. If you tackle a particularly vicious pour without taking the proper care, you are bound to splash all over. Your whole day is ruined. To demonstrate proper pouring technique, this I shall apply my neat. face protector. I like this. <laughs> Splendid. Now the optimal That's way creepy. to pour milk is to raise the pouring container and angle it at no more than 45 <laughs> degrees positively as you approach your drinking vessel. Is this a I game? Now begin to pour. I really hope this is a game. Oh! <laughs> I was not ready for that. Oh, holy crap. Woo! <laughs> oh, my day. Holy crap! <laughs> Shoot! No! Uh, in a month! No, in a month! No, no dreaming. Cuphead is coming to the Nintendo Switch oh! system. Oh! NBA, I did not see that coming. So special, I did not see this Microsoft coming at all. No, Cuphead I did not. Uh-uh. Shoot! As fans know, poor Cuphead made a deal with the devil. And now the beast is coming for his head, cup and all. This, In this is crazy. Game, you'll dodge fire and dish out your own. So, you does this mean Cuphead's gonna ride. be in Smash? Like, that'd be the best. Style look as good as ever. And the live jazz soundtrack by Christopher Golly. Golly. I've played this game on Xbox One. It is Cuphead nearly on impossible. It's available for pre-purchase today. Good golly gosh. One man okay. is prepared to destroy oh, anyone. Oh, I sight. saw a donkey He's video about this game. Ballet. All while <laughs> oh, this, it looks dope. Named Pedro. Using his arsenal of absolutely crazy skills, you'll battle through the violent <laughs> underworld with Old Town, District Null, and beyond. Go full throttle with all your weapons and That's your body. Cool. Jumping, flipping, I and like swinging, the physics of it a lot. Since you'll be running and gunning, there's bound to be chaos. Slow things down by shifting <laughs> in slow motion to pace your actions. It looks and awesome. Do destruction with elegant accuracy. In this dystopic future, they're doing the video games on Uber drivers now. Run by automation. Your choices like picking passengers, balancing your income, sustaining a positive rating, and managing your emotions via the Feel Grid system are all elements you need to maintain to keep your job. And find your friend. That's oh, exactly what it is. Forget. It's Cat Uber, Rock the is video free. game. Neo what Cat the heck? Is scheduled to arrive on Nintendo Switch this summer. Then we must find the one who is Red. Okay. That's kind of cool how right. flowers grow everywhere you walk. Mutation. Mutation. Oh wow, Mutation. you get turned into different monsters. Hmm, that's Tank. pretty cool. What the freak? <laughs> that's freaking weird. That's so cool though. <laughs> I 
I really hope this 80s, 90s soundtrack is part of the official game soundtrack, because it's jamming. It's dope. The child shows promise, but the time has come for their real quest to begin. You are rad. That's rad, dude. <laughs> Yeah, the game looks pretty cool. It looks pretty rad. <laughs> okay, I'll stop making those jokes. Hey, we got more Breath of the Wild DLC coming in, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> what is this? I hear those gators. <laughs> Come here, Foxman. Let's go. <laughs> ha! You see that? I just killed the ground. I'll get you. <laughs> this is so funny. Oh, man. get him. Demigoron's gonna get ya! I don't know, like, this is season three. Is the Demigoron even a thing at this point? I don't know. I don't watch, I don't watch this show. Finally, I'm almost out of this crypt. But this isn't the world I remember. Is this supposed to be their this guy's one world? more thing moment? And that Wait, I think I was called here for a purpose. It looks like I've got work to do. What? And this time, what? I have help. What? Whoa! Hang on. Hang on. What? What? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Freak. Cadence of high. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's neat. That's neat. Wow. I, holy cow. Gosh, dang it. The biggest takeaway Cuphead. Come on, Cuphead. I would have never dreamed Cuphead coming to the Switch. I always thought it would just be an Xbox exclusive the whole time. And with those rumors earlier, a couple weeks ago, about like, a Microsoft exclusive like coming to the switch and stuff like man I was thinking like Halo or something like that since Halo's come to Steam like it would have made sense for Halo to come to switch too but Cuphead's pretty good too Cuphead is just as big of a surprise as anything else would have been okay the, the very last game that just came up I have no idea who Cadence is but her collab with Zelda looks pretty cool like that, 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 that's really cool that Nintendo is giving their IPs to indie artists especially since indie uh, game developers are able to make these really good quality games Nintendo is recognizing that they can lend their IPs over to them and collab with them more that is really really cool my friend Pedro looks really cool. I definitely want to get that game. I, I really, really like video game Donkey. I really trust his opinion on video games. And he said some good things about that one. Rad, okay. Rad looks pretty cool too. Not gonna throw out any puns. Like we've had enough of those. But yeah, Rad looks really cool. I, it lo really looks unique how you like, how all the plants grow at, everywhere he walks and he gets to turn into the enemies that he beats, I guess. 
It's like one of the reasons why I like Super Mario Odyssey, and it looks like one of the cool things about this game too, without exactly copying the formula of Super Mario Odyssey, so that's awesome. The more and more I own a Switch, the more and more intrigued I am by indie games and what they bring to the table. Just some really awesome and unique tiles out there. Lately I've been into Hollow Knight a lot, I've been into Undertale, and I'm getting more and more of an appreciation for indie titles and the hard work that developers put into them without being backed up 100% by big developers like Nintendo, Microsoft, or uh, Sony. The biggest takeaways I had from this, Cuphead, my friend Pedro, Rad, and maybe, maybe this Cadence and Zelda game. But yeah, those, those are my top three that look really, really cool and stuff that I'm definitely gonna be looking into.